region of Murcia is an autonomous community of Spain located in the southeast of the state, between Andalusia and Valenciennes community, on the Mediterranean coast. The autonomous community consists of a single province, unlike most autonomous communities, which have several provinces within the same territory. Because of this, the autonomous community and the province are operated as one unit of government. The city of Murcia is the capital of the region and seat of government organs, except for the parliament, the regional assembly of Murcia, which is located in Cartagena. The autonomous community and province is subdivided into municipalities. The region of Murcia is bordered by Andalusia, Castile-La Mancha, the Valenciang community, and the Mediterranean Sea. The community measures 11,313 square kilometers and has a population of 1.4 million, of whom one-third live in the capital. The highest mountain is Los Obispos. The region is a major producer of fruits, vegetables, and flowers for the rest of Spain and Europe. Wineries have developed near the towns of Bullis, Yecla, and Jamala, as well as olive oil near Moritala. Murcia is mainly a warm region which has made it very suitable for agriculture. However, the precipitation level is low and water supply is a hot subject today since, in addition to the traditional water demand for crops, there is now also a demand of water for the booming tourist developments. Water is supplied by the Segura River and, since the 1970s, by the Tejo Transvasement, a major civil engineering project which, under some environmental and sustainability restraints, brings water from the Tejo into the Segura. Geography Relief The region is located in the eastern part of the Cordilleras Beticus Mountains and it is influenced by their orography. These mountain ranges are divided as well in the Pre-Betica, Sub-Betica and Penny-Betica mountain ranges. Traditionally it has been considered that the peak of Revolcadors, in the range of the same name it was the highest point in the region of Mercia, with a height of 2,027 meters, but in measurements of the most recent maps of the Snig, Revolcadors appears with a height of 1,999 meters. And the mountain, Los Obispos, located slightly further north, is higher. Approximately 27% of the Merchant territory can be described as mountainous, 38% is intramountainous depressions and running valleys, and the remaining 35% is flatlands and plateau. Climatology The region of Mercia enjoys a Mediterranean climate of semi-arid type, with mild winters and warm summers. The average annual temperature is 18 degrees Celsius, with little precipitation of about 300 to 350 millimeters per year. The region has between 120 and 150 days in the year where the sky is totally clear. April and October are the months with the most precipitation, there being frequent heavy downpours in a single day. The distance to the sea and the relief causes a thermal difference between the coast and the interior, especially in winter, when the temperature rarely descends below 10 degrees Celsius on the coast, while in the interior regions the minimum does not usually rise above 6 degrees Celsius and the precipitation level is higher. The city of Murcia holds the record temperature of the 20th century in Spain. It reached 46.1 degrees Celsius on July 4, 1994. The winter of 2005 was the coldest in a long time, with snow even falling on the Merchan coast. Hydrography rivers The hydrographic network of the region is made up of the Segura River and its affluents. Mando, it is the one that contributes to the Segura with the greatest volume. al Harabi and its affluent, the Benamor, Mula River, Guadalentine, Sanganera or Rigueron. Due to the water supplying incapacity of the Segura River Basin, contributions to this river basin are made. Originated from the basin of the Tejo River, by means of the Tejo Segura transvasement, seas the greatest natural lake of Spain can be found in the region.
The Marmena Lagoon. It is a saltwater lagoon, adjacent to the Mediterranean Sea. Its special ecological and natural characteristics make the Marmena a unique natural place and the largest saltwater lake in Europe. With a semi-circular shape, it is separated from the Mediterranean Sea by a sand strip 22 kilometers in length and between 100 and 1,200 meters wide. Known as La Manga del Marmena, the lagoon has been designated by the United Nations as a specially protected zone of importance for the Mediterranean. Its coastal perimeter accounts for 73 kilometers of coast in which beaches follow one another with crystal clear shallow water. The lake has an area of 170 square kilometers. History the Carthaginians established a permanent trading port on the coast of Carthagena, which the Romans called Carthago Nova. For the Carthaginian traders, the mountainous territory was merely the Iberian hinterland of their seacoast empire. During the Roman period Mercia did not exist but its actual borders could have been inside of the province of Hispania Carthaginensis under the Moors, who introduced the large-scale irrigation on which merchant agriculture depends, the province was known as Todmir. It included, according to Idrisi, the 12th-century Arab cartographer based in Sicily, the cities of Orihuela, Lorca, Mula and Chinchilla, Spain. The Kingdom of Mercia became independent as a typhus centered on the Moorish city of Mercia after the fall of the Umayyad Caliphate of Cordoba. Moorish typha of Mercia included Albacete and part of Almeria as well. After the Battle of Sagrajas in 1086, the Almoravid dynasty swallowed up the typhus and reunited Islamic Spain. Ferdinand III of Castile received the submission of the Moorish king of Mercia in 1243 under the terms of the Treaty of Alcaraz. In the usual way, the Muslims were evicted from the cities, and Ferdinand's heir Alfonso X of Castile, who benefited from rule over a largely depopulated Mercia, divided the border kingdom in three regions for administrative purposes entrusted respectively to the Consejos de Rielengo, to the ecclesiastical senores seculares, as a reward for their contributions to the Reconquista and to the military orders founded in the 11th century. Alfonso annexed the Typha of Mercia as King of Mercia outright in 1266, and it remained technically a vassal kingdom of Spain until the reforms in the Liberal Constitution of 1812. Mercia became an autonomous region in 1982. The Castilian conquest of Mercia was significant because it gave the former access to the Mediterranean for the first time and ended the expansion of the Kingdom of Aragon which had been moving south along the coast. Demography the region of Mercia has a population of 1,424,063 inhabitants, of which almost a third live in the municipality of Mercia. It makes up 3.0% of the Spanish population. In addition, after Ceuta and Melilla, Mercia has the highest population growth and also the highest birth rate of the country. Birth rate, 13.00 per 1,000. Mortality rate, 7.48 per 1,000. Life expectancy, men, 76.01 years women, 82.00 years. In the 1991-2005 to 2005 period the Merchan population grew at by 26.06%, as opposed to the national average of 11.85%. 12.35% of the inhabitants are of foreign origin, according to the Ein 2005 census, which is 4% more than the Spanish average. The most notable groups of immigrants are Ecuadorians, Moroccans, Britons, Bolivians and Colombians. Municipalities the region of Mercia comprises 45 municipalities, the most populated being Mercia, Cartagena, Lorca, and Molina de Segura. Language The Spanish spoken in the region has its own accent and local words. The Merchan dialect tends to eliminate many syllable final consonants and to emphasize regional vocabulary, much of which is derived from Aragonese, Catalan and Arabic words. 
the general intonation and some of the distinctive vocabulary of the Spanish dialect spoken in Murcia share several traits with the one spoken in the neighboring province of Almeria, in Andalusia, and the Viga Baja del Segura in the Alicante province. Valenciennes is spoken in a small area of the region known as El Carch. Tourism. Despite the famous seaside resorts, the overall region is relatively unknown even within Spain, so it continues to be relatively unspoilt compared to other more overcrowded areas of the Spanish Mediterranean coast. Nevertheless, it's more than 300 sunny days a year with an average temperature of 21 degrees Celsius and the 250 kilometers of beaches of the so-called Costa Colida have attracted tourists for decades. The region is also being promoted as a cultural destination with a lot of highlights for visitors, monuments, gastronomy, cultural events, museums, historic remains, festivals etc. The region of Murcia is one of the Spanish autonomous communities that has grown the most in the last years and this has conferred it the character of an ideal destination of services, shopping and for the organization of cultural events and conventions. Cultural tourism Major tourist destinations Mercia, the capital city, offers the facilities, equipment and services of a large city. It is the seventh largest Spanish city by population with approximately 440,000 inhabitants in 2009. Mercia's sites include the very tall belfry and its famous cathedral. Mercia is also a large university town with more than 30,000 students per year. It has more than 2 million km2 of parks and gardens. Mercia has a rich history tied to the Jewish community. Cartagena is the region's second largest city and one of the main Spanish naval bases. Sites include its recently restored Roman theatre and a number of modernist buildings made for its military fortifications. Lorca is a large medieval town at the foothills of which its famous castle stands. It is the second largest municipality of Spain by area. Caravaca de la Cruz, or simply Caravaca, is one of the five official holy cities for Catholicism since it is claimed to house a part of the Lignum Crucis, the Holy Cross. The castle's itinerary The interior of the region of Mercia has plenty of castles and fortifications showing the importance of these frontier lands. Between the Christian Castile and the Muslim Andalusia, they include Castle of Jumala, a former Roman fortification turned by the Moors into an Alcazaba. The Castilian kings and the Marquis of Elena gave it its appearance of Gothic royal residence. Castle of Moritella, one of the largest castles of the province, built to defend the town of Moritella from the invaders from the nearby Muslim kingdom of Granada. Castle of Mula, of Muslim origin, but as with many castles, eventually restored and renovated. Real Alcazar of Caravaca de la Cruz, where the holy sanctuary was built, also of Moorish origin, conquered by the Christians and finally home of several noble families. Concepcion Castle, in Cartagena, built on one of the five hills of the old Carthagena, following the Roman taste now is home of the Center for the Interpretation of Cartagena's History. Lorca Castle, also known as the Fortress of the Sun. Festivities Cartagena's and Lorca's Holy Week's processions have been declared of international tourist interest. Together the Murcia's Bando de la Huerta and the burial of the Sardine in Murcia included in its spring festivities. Mercia's Holy Week is also interesting since its processions include merchant sculptor Francisco Salcio's statues. Cartagena's main festivities are the Carthaginases y Romanos, reenacting the Punic Wars. They have been declared of national tourist interest. The Agulas Carnival is one of the most important and colorful of Spain. Beaches and golf This is the most developed tourist resource in Mercia. The Costa Colida has 250 kilometers of beaches, from El Mojón at the north near Alicante to Agulas, southwest Mercia, near Almeria. One of the major destinations of Mercia is the Mar Mena or Small Sea, the largest natural lake of Spain and the largest salty lagoon in Europe.
Located by the Mediterranean, it is separated from the Mediterranean by a 22 km narrow sandy strip known as La Manga del Mar Mena or simply La Manga. It is probably the most developed and overcrowded holiday area of Mercia. Despite being declared a specially protected area of Mediterranean importance by the United Nations, Mar Mena's muts are famous for its therapeutic properties. Apart from Mar Meno, the Merchan coast from the historical city of Cartagena to the frontier with Andalusia, that corresponds to the Mediterranean Sea alternates wild and unspoilt rocky areas with large sandy beaches, with the towns of Mazarin and Agula standing out. The tourism needs have forced the area to add all kinds of facilities and services. The construction boom shows the huge amount of estates, including the controversial holiday resorts of Polaris World and second residences, as well as numerous malls. Thanks to the orography and climate of the region of Mercia, these lands are suitable for golf courses, a fact that has been very controversial because of the need for water, which Mercia lacks being a very dry region. Other services includes nautical charters, yacht facilities, golf courses, adventure tourism companies, sports federations, tourist routes, guided visits and excursions by sea, natural resources and rural tourism. The region of Mercia has 19 areas under different statutes of protection, representing 6% of its territory. The Sierra Espuna, a protected natural space, has an area of 17,804 hectares. It is located on the Bietic Cordillera within the basin of the Segura. This regional park is centered around the 1583M Sierra Espuna mountain. It is also declared a special protected area for the birds. Salinas y Arenalis de San Pedro del Pinatar, a salt marsh by the Mar Mena. Carbo Cope Puntas del Calnagri, between Agulis and Lorca, by the Mediterranean Sea. The government of Mercia has amended Law 1 2001 of 24 April on land in the region of Mercia, declassifying a total of 1,600 hectares of the land protected by the regional park of Carbo Cope and Puntas de Calnagri. Res species of animals and plants are threatened. Calblanc, Monte de las Senas Arch y Peña del Agula, between La Manga and Cartagena. Calblanc is also one of the top favorite beaches for the merchants although it is an undeveloped area. Carrascoy y El Vale is a special protection area and site of community importance. Sierra de la Pila, also a special protection area. Sierra del Carch, also part of the Biotic Cordillera. Canander Almadines, Humedale de la Juic y Ramblas Saladar, another wetland and also a special protection area. Cerro de Cabazo Gordo, in which there is the archaeological site of Cima de las Palomas, a cave where the second oldest human remains in the Iberian Peninsula were found. La Muela y Cabo Tinazo. A group of islands and islets on the Merchan Mediterranean has a high ecological importance. Espacios Abiertos y Islas del Mar Mena, in which the five volcanic islands of the Mar Mena are included. Sierra de las Moras, Canaverosa, Sierra de Salinas, Barrancos de Gebas, Saladares del Guadalentine, Cuatro Calis. In the lands of the region, near the historical towns of Caravaca de la Cruz and Moratala, offer a number of rural accommodations and facilities, cottages, farmhouses, country houses and campsites. Visitors can engage in activities related to excursions, day trips, sports, sightseeing, transport, San Javier Mercia Airport. Alicante Airport, although outside Mercia, it is also used by air travelers. Cartagena Seaport, 